Greetings to all my viewers and subscribers. Guys, thank you for coming back to watch my video, subscribing to my channel. I really don't take you for granted. So let's get into the video now. The murder in Grand Penn, St. Andrew. Police on the scene of a double murder in Grand Spen St. Andrew community on Sunday. Two men were killed in a drive-by shooting about 3 p.m. A third man who was shot in the incident is said to be in, at hospital. The deceased men who are not of Grand Spen Avenue addresses were not identified at the time of news report. Police reports that the killers abandoned a car in Richmond Park, St. Andrew, and were able to elude cops. Police sources say the deaths have nothing to do with a conflict associated with popular entertainer Jashi, whose brother was killed in the community the day before. Crystal armor found on the mattress seized in portland a man was arrested after a pistol and several rounds of ammunition were reportedly found under a mattress in his bedroom in his community of binning lane shrewbury district portland on sunday reports from the hope bay police are that about midday lawmen carried out an operation at the location occupied by a man the premises was searched and one Glock 23 pistol with 13.40 rounds of ammunition cartridges were seized under a mattress inside the man's bedroom. He was arrested and taken into custody pending further investigation. Bandsman one done gang sentencing set for today. The highly anticipated sentencing of the Klansman Juan Don, gang leader Andre Blackman, Brian, and 14 other gang members is set for today in the Home Circuit Court. Brian was found guilty of being a leader of a criminal organization, while the other gangsters, including Stephanie Muma, Cole Christie, a so-called pastor from St. Thomas, were found guilty of being a member of the St. Catherine base gang. The charge of leadership of a criminal organization attracts a maximum sentence of 30 years, while gang membership and facilitating gang activities both have a maximum of 20 years. The judge also has the power under the anti-gang legislation to order at least two consecutive sentences. For hell does cops find eight stolen goats stuffed in a car trunk. Four men are in custody following the recovery of eight goats that were stolen on the Cameron Hill Main Road in St. Elizabeth on Sunday, September 24. Reports from the police are that at about 6.30 a.m., a team of officers acting on intelligence intercepted a Toyota Corolla motor car in the area. The vehicle and its occupants were searched and eight goats were found in the trunk. The men were unable to account for the animals, hence they were arrested. The fourth man was subsequently arrested following further investigations. The owner has since identified the herd. Acting Superintendent of Police Coleridge Minton in a statement highlighted that Pradial Larceny remains a priority in the parish and will continue to work to apprehend all perpetrators and bring Pradial Larceny under control in the St. Elizabeth Division. <music> Cops seize gun during raid in Grand Spain, one man arrested. Detectives attached to the St. Andrew Police Division seized a firearm and ammunition following a snap raid in Adman Lane, Grand Spen, Kingston 8, on Sunday, September 24th. Reports from the police are that about 11 p.m., lawmen conducted a raid in the area and a premises search. During the search, 
one Taurus 9mm pistol with a magazine containing 12mm rounds of ammunition were found inside a suitcase in the bedroom. One man was taken into custody. Guys, thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, share, and comment down below.